Hey everyone, thanks for joining us on Ludicrous Feed. You're with Tesla Tom this morning. I wanted to talk to you today about my Tesla Model S and comparing it with a real world example uh, of charging my car versus using petrol for an internal combustion engine vehicle. I've got a real world example here of a petrol receipt or a gas receipt from my wife's Mazda CX-5. She bought some petrol the other day. Uh, she bought 37.68 litres worth of petrol or gasoline at $1.41. She got a bit of a discount with the local grocery store deal. Um, so she paid $51.58 for 37.68 litres. Now I'm going to go through some mathematics here. And on this side, we're going to put up some slides so that you can follow along with the numbers. So uh, most internal combustion engine vehicles um, run at an efficiency of 10 uh, kilometers per liter of petrol. That's for average city driving. So at 37.68 liters, she is going to get 376.8 kilometers worth of range uh, for that amount of petrol. So if you watch some of my other videos, uh, you'll know that it requires uh, one kilowatt hour to run five kilometers worth of range. So if you want to use 376.8 kilometers uh, worth of range, you will require 376.8 divided by 5 kilowatt hours per kilometer, and that means you will need 75.36 kilowatt hours worth of charge for your car. Now, I know that with my other video, I've shown you that um, you lose a bit of charge every night, but just for simplicity's sake, let's just say you need 75.36 uh, kilowatt hours worth of charge to uh, run an equivalent range of 376.8 kilometers which requires 37.68 uh, liters worth of petrol or gasoline. So that's a bit of a like for like comparison. So uh, there are three ways to calculate this. In New South Wales, there is a standard tariff of 30 cents per kilowatt hour. So if you require 75.36 kilowatt hours and you're paying 30 cents per kilowatt hour, you will need $22.61 uh, to, to reach that amount of charge. Uh, if you're on a time of use tariff, uh, which I'm on, you are paying 16 and a half cents kil per kilowatt hour um, between 10 p.m. and 6 a 7 a.m. every every night. <clears throat> so if you are paying uh, 0.165 dollars or 16.5 cents and you need 75.36 kilowatt hours, then you're paying 12 dollars and 43 cents for that amount of electricity. If you're on AGL's one dollar per day uh, plan. Um, and my wife pumps petrol every week, let's just say for seven days worth of electricity, and you're paying $1 per day, that's $7 flat for um, that much electricity, if not more, if you're needing more of that um, charge. So, so I'll break it down for you now. There are four, um, four ways to get this amount of range, 376.8 kilometers. You can pay $51.58 at the petrol pump. You can pay $22 if you're on a standard tariff. You can pay $12.43 if you're on a time of use tariff and you're charging at off peak rates at 16 and a half cents. If you're on AGL's $1 per day plan, you're paying $7. So as you can see with an electric vehicle, you are paying less for electricity. It's far more convenient. My car is charging right now. Um, you don't have to go to a smelly gas station, uh, pay the attendant, wipe your hands, dry your hands, clean your hands after touching uh, the petrol pump. Uh, you don't have to wait 15 minutes potentially for a petrol pump to free up. You don't have to wait uh, for a cheap day of the week as uh, my wife does because there is a petrol cycle here in New South Wales where it gets cheaper on certain days of the week. Uh, you can charge at home. It takes five seconds to charge a vehicle. You can pop inside um, and have some dinner. So there you have it guys. That's my breakdown of uh, uh, an internal combustion engine vehicle using petrol versus an electric vehicle using electricity for an equivalent amount of range using a real world example. Well, thank you for watching. It's a lovely day here in Sydney, a little bit brisk, a little bit fresh. It is getting into winter almost, uh, but the sun is still out. However, the, the heaters are coming on at night time because it is getting colder. So we are using more electricity this time of year. Hopefully it's nice where you are as well. Thank you always for watching. And as always, happy charging. Hey, thanks for watching, and thank you for helping us to bring the electric vehicle revolution to Australia. If you've enjoyed our videos, please take a moment to hit subscribe. We'd really appreciate it. 
If you're close to buying a brand new Tesla, then lucky you. Use one of our promo codes on screen to unlock special goodies from Tesla. Happy charging!